We are in Chinchero and we are now going to a traditional textile facility. We are entering the sketchy door. Yeah, we are getting into now. Very nice. Wow, this is cool. We have some of those plows and stuff. Should I ring this bell? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and here they are farming guinea pigs too, no? Oh, guinea pigs. Yeah, guinea pig farming. Right above where they're going to be cooked. It's very good. Yeah. Self-sustaining. Self-sustaining. Guinea, guinea pig farming oh, is wow. extremely... Guinea pigs, people... Low resource intensive. People think, you know, guinea pigs, why would you have guinea pigs? Uh, it's very similar to rabbits. They multiply quickly, they're low import. And, and they if, need very little space. And if you need food, one of these is good for one meal for a family. It's not like a cow or something, you have to then worry about it. How the protein of the guinea pig meat is much more than the uh, Higher the protein. Yeah, higher wow. protein, yeah. Okay. And here, this, this, is, a, this is all natural textiles. All natural dyes. Natural dyes. All natural fibers and natural dyes. And this is the real market. And here also we have our llamas. Llamas? That's where the wool comes from. Who are these birds? Llamas and alpacas. And alpacas, alpacas uris. So alpacas? Alpacas there in the left side, yeah. Would you like to say something, Lama? <laughs> Would you like to say something? He's going to spit at me. Yeah, he's, he's not <laughs> very happy with you right now. <laughs> okay, don't let me check out. Chicos, please get inside here. Okay. And the lady? The llama? Yeah. So she's one explaining about all the process of the textile that we have. Oh, oh he's going to give it for you to, to worry now. You're already ah. Wow. <laughs> David, you look good. Ah, oh. hi, Tachirasa. Fitting colors. Yes. Okay. Un momentito, no, please. Sí, sí. Así, con esto. It's good. This is like uh, pajamas. It feels very comfortable. Hey. Now. Good morning. Welcome to Chinchero. In this opportunity, I'm going to study textile. My name is Ruth. Yeah. This is the singer. This is the Quechua language. Vamos a cantarle una canción. Mm -hmm. Ah, she's gonna sing a song for us. Oh. Ya. Eh, y dice así: Chinchero, Plaza Pata, Pis, Pasnita y Papa Monte. Cayachus, Munana Kanki, No Capas, Munanas Kanki, No Capas, Guayunas Kanki. Apas pa, apa ku, ay pusas pa, pusa ku. Wasi manta, wasi chayki man, yachta y manta, yachta chayki. Wasi manta, wasi chayki. Thank you. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. And this is the root we call it the sahta. This is the natural detergent. Yeah? So start with cool yeah, we call it Inca shampoo. Oh. The Inca shampoo is the prevent the gray hair. In my community, this is for ladies is the hair. This is only black hair, no white hair. No gray hair, yeah? And what kind of root is that? Sakta. Sakta. Sakta root. Yeah, or such a parakai. So it's natural soap. Yeah. Natural shampoo. Shampoo. It's the shampoo, yeah. That's what they wash the now is the filter. This is a technology. So filter all of the water out. Or the bits. This is the natural sun bubble. We call it Inca shampoo. Yeah, it's in this natural sun bubble. This is the sheep wool. This is very dirty. The sheep wool. Yeah, this is the same process. The sheep wool or alpaca this is the same process. This is the washing. And this is this is the end pot boiler. This is for ten or fifteen minutes. It's different the white color. So for ten or fifteen minutes, you sit it in there. And this. Wow. This is the natural chocolate. <laughs> wow. Mm. Have a look. This Whoa. is a different, much better for wow. the machine. Yeah. This for other process, this is the spinning, this is no problem. Can you dancing, cooking, can you carry the baby, this is no problem. 
So you're just doing this all the time? Yeah. All the time. Yeah. She's making all the time. So you spin it. Yeah. Oh, spin and pull. Spin and pull. This is to break, this is pulling together, no knots. Oh, if you break it, you just put it. Yeah. No knots. This is a perfect. This one. Oh, so you do a knot at the top? This. This is a perfect, yeah? For other process, for different the color, this different plants, flower, and mats, this is the natural color, yeah? And this is the plant, this is the core, this is the pepper color, this is a middle, full of them, this is a different tonality, the color, this is the pepper color, no? Purple color with the Yeah, and this one. Maize. This is, uh, yeah, this is the maize. This is the water, this is the trap, the chicha morada, is in this one. This is a middle, for of them, this is a different tonality. Oh, so this, and this one. For water. This the chicha morada. To, for drinking? Yeah. And then, then the leftover is this. And this one, this is for of them, this is a different. And then they use that to yeah. color it. And this is the plant, this is the, the three corner, we call it skin sacucho, this is the quechua name. Proof then this is a different the blue color, I change the color, this is the children urine, because not the adult, this adult is contaminated. Is that a, a, a cactus? No. no, this is the three corner. Three kernels? Yeah, mm -hmm. we call it skin sacucho, this is the medicinal plant. Wow. Awesome. Yeah. So first it's white, and then you mix it. Yeah. Yeah. You dip in the water, boil water, and you can put like the bar, that purple corn, and you get the different kind of purples, then you use this. This is for one hour, so 40 stuff. minutes, 30 minutes, it's different tonality of the colors. Yeah? And this is the plant, this is the tara bean, for often these are these colors. Yeah? And this one is the koji flowers, and retama flowers, for often these are different the yellow colors. This the, and this is the mud, I live in Ulantitambo, and Machu Picchu for rockeros, we call it kakasunka. For often these are different the orange colors. This is the chilka leaves. This is the same the coca leaves. For often this is a different the green colors. The most important is in this one. Tia, cactus chat up near a pie up para mucho. And this one is the cactus. Yeah? Do you know the cactus? Cactus, uh-huh. Yeah? And this one, this is the cochinilla. This is a beetle. This is the parasite. Oh, there's a beetle inside? Yeah. Yeah. Small one. It grows more as a parasite, and it's in yellow, yellow parts that you have there. So in this one. Some. Oh, the white is the parasite. Yeah, exactly. yeah. It's a beetle. It's this a bug. is not the white color. This is the black. Oh. In this one, this is the parasite. So it's the it's it's not the cactus. It's the uh, the beetle on yeah. the cactus. So. Yeah. And then it grinds to this. Yeah. Working now. Mm. This is the parasite. Is the export for cosmetic. Oh. Yeah, this is the parasite. Yeah, I sacrificed for your visit. The first colors. This is the cochineal. I'm glad I'm teaching her. The the cochineal. This is a different the red color. This is in this one. Yeah, this mm -hmm. is the salt. This is the salinas. The maras morai. Salt. Yeah, other oh, colors. So you put salt with the parasite. It makes yeah. red. Yeah. This is the other tonality, this is the alum, store, no quartz, this is the alum. In this one, other colors. Darker red. Yeah, in my community, this is for ladies, this is the natural lipsticks, like this. Oh. Yeah. This is the natural lipstick. This is the one that's in 24 hours. Resistance is 100 kisses. Wow. Yeah, this, <laughs> is, this, is kisses. this is the lemon fly one, yeah? The other process, this is the combination, the color is in this one. This is for two person, it's in this. No, this is the same process. Come on here, please. Mm. And this one, this is the same process. Same this, process. Yeah. The most important is in this one, this is the question, what is it? 
So bone? Yeah, bone off. Llama? No. no. My husband. <laughs> bone of your husband? <laughs> Talk too much? No. <laughs> no good. Human? Yeah. Human bone? Yeah. This is a tourist bone. Tourist they didn't buy bones. anything. Oh, they didn't buy anything. I see. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is how you cannot tour this one. This is the llama walpaca bone. This is the femur. Yeah? The femur bone. This is, and this one, this is for tyke and tyke. We call it rookie. This is the same process. And this one for ladies, this is not any copy any book in a computer. This is in memory. This is a 40 descent. No necessary the copy, the book, no. Yeah, and this one is different pattern, is different design, yeah. And this is the same we call it Loraipo. This is typical from here. For two circle represent, this is for two like. For woman and men, this is a duality. And this is the S represent, this is the agriculture. Yeah, they will call it Scuti. This is the condor pick. It's in this. This is the final process, this is not the border. This is the border, this other process. We call it Nyawi Awapa. This is the princess eyes. This is one side and two sides. This is the handmade. The machine this is only one side, this is the handmade, this is two sides. One and two sides. Mm. You question for me? No. No? That's incredible. Okay. And this, uh, the baby alpaca, this is the primer first. Yeah? Adult alpaca, second first. This is a different. This is the sheep bull in this one. Yeah? Uh, thank you for the visit, thank you for the attention, and this house is in a Teddy family different. You start present this different community. Yeah, your collaboration, your pen is no problem, Teddy card, American dollar, no problem. Okay. Thank you. Did you know? <laughs> Toyota. ¿Qué me dijo? Toyota. ¿Conoces Toyota? Uh, Toyota. Car? El carro, Toyota. Yeah. Why sí. is there Toyota? Because his mother, Toyota's mother, did this by hand. Uh -huh. And the son said, my, my mother is very, worked very hard. I want to make her life easier. Where are you from? Yeah. From the United States. Oh, but from, from this, Mr. Toyota designed a loom, the first machine uh, out of wood to make it. And then Toyota became a loom maker. They made the machines that made this. Then in the 30s, they started making cars. Mm. Oh, wow. So really Toyota is why the Chinese now have flooded the markets with <laughs> the it's cheap textiles. Chinese. Textile. <laughs> by accident, by accident. Si. <laughs> accident. Si. And we are in a traditional textile factory effectively. And uh, they'll even do everything from shear the wool here In a demonstration earlier about the coloring, how they naturally dyed. So all the colors you see are all naturally dyed colors. And these are the raw materials that are used. You see the yarn. And they start from, you know, that al uh, alpaca right there is pretty dirty. And so they start with just dirty wool, the dirty wool washing demonstration, and all the way to making it into yarn. We have different coloring instruments here and food. We have some chuños here. Different types of potatoes here. And these potatoes look like they're starting to chit. We're chitting these potatoes. This is gonna be for planting. So they're gonna be planting these, which is incredible. There's some of these as well, these more unusual types of potatoes. Unusual types of corn. They're chitting, and these are actually green potatoes, which is very interesting because in the States we're taught not to make interesting corn. And then over here, there's a uh, guinea guinea pig operation. They have an oven, and they have a little guinea pig hut. <coughs> and uh, you see, they're all running away. But uh, they serve the same purpose that rabbits do. In fact, if in the United States, if you go back to the 1940s, World War II time, and before, every cookbook will have a rabbit in it. Because for food storage purposes, you just keep the rabbits alive until you want to eat them. And so they're small and divisible. They multiply quickly, and uh, each one makes a nice, simple meal. So people might say, oh my gosh, they're pets, blah, blah, blah. Well, from a cultural standpoint, 
uh, the guinea or the called kui here are very important. And then they have their oven above there where they're cooking inside their little courtyard. So this is incredible little place. All right, here we are outside of Chinchero and there's this massive market, right? Stone Gate. I just thought it was like a farmer's market. They said vegetables. No, this, up to an archaeological site. the whole thing, right? There's, there's remnants of the fortress we were just at, the palace. But this whole thing is only for potatoes. It's a potato market on Saturdays and Sundays. And so they're not operational now and we won't be coming back. But this, all these different types of potatoes. And also corn. Huh? And corn. That's the two things that are here. And they're everywhere. And this is a very famous picture of the book. All different kinds of, you'll never even Peruvians have to go to the back country like here to be able to buy it. All the countries, all the pictures were taken here of all the different potatoes that are at this market. All right, so where are we at, Jordan? We are now in the local market of Pisek, where are more of the most beautiful, like, like places like silver stuff, like the alpaca meat, like the alpaca sweaters. A really colorful like place that we can identify like how like beauty is this place how like activated is this place so if you want to get silver from anywhere in Peru you would come to Pisac it's better it's and better you come to this market because the quality is high and they have the same thing that your ancestor used for more than 300 years wow yeah. all right so the side shoot of the market we go through this and this is a traditional empanadas oven it was a community oven I got some markets here. But these are the best empanadas in the, the world. Best empanadas in the world. In the world. You have to come here and try. This is incredible. Yeah. So this used to be a community oven? Uh, is the, uh, yeah, it's the community. It's like the only oven that used to be in all the pizza city. Okay. So when you have a festivities, you want to make like, like bring the chicken here, the poor, or just make empanadas, you have to come here and put it inside of the small. Okay. All right, so this is a 200 year old oven. We're gonna try these traditional empanadas. Mmm. Mm. Wow, these are incredible. Look at this. The cheese, onion. This, this, this oven is 200 years old. And it gets passed down, right? Exactly. It's passed down to the next generation. Oh my gosh, you guys gotta come try that. <laughs> What's the name of the hotel? The Sky Hotel? Yeah, the Sky, the Sky Domes. Sky Domes. Sky Domes. Uh, so Sky Domes Hotel is right here, right by this brewery. So this is where I would be if I stayed in a thousand dollar room for a night place. Uh, also, if you are vegetarian or vegan, this ceviche is the best option for you. Mushroom ceviche. Mushroom ceviche. Or local mushroom. Incredible. Boom, bam, ba, da, ba, ba, bam, ba, boom, bam, ba, da, ba, ba, bam, 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 b